All right, so a uh, quick little video. Um, Troy and I have been messing with the Phantom 4 uh, Pro a bit today, and it kept saying that it needed to upgrade the firmware, and we tried to download the DJI Go 4 Assistant, or the DJI Assistant, and run that from the PC, but while, before we got there, Troy found another YouTuber, which, uh, thanks to that guy, um, told us what to do. The important thing here is you want to go into your DJI Go app, and this is on the Pro, um, and click on the Upgrade Firmware button. But um, where we were messing up before is we were using the large USB port in the back of this controller, that big USB port, and then going directly into the small USB port in the quad, which is that one right there. Didn't see any reason why that wouldn't work. However, it wasn't working. Uh, the, they weren't seeing each other. As soon as we actually used this little adapter that DJI gives you and went from the small USB port on the quad to the small USB port on the remote, everything started working. So we just did the um, firmware update. So I'm gonna go, it says upgrade firmware. I'm gonna go back to GoFly and it says firmware upgrade required. Well, let's see. So updates required. Yep, okay. Interesting. Um, I thought we had just done the upgrade, but let's do this. Let's let's just power cycle both the quad and the remote. Wi-Fi. Yeah, we still have Wi-Fi. This has still got a good connection here. So we just re-power cycled the quad and the remote. And now if we hit go fly. It says latest firmware and uh, Oh, now it says updates required. And now it's gone back to this, connected with aircraft. So I'm gonna click there. I shall click over here. And it says downloading. So it's 83 megabytes, so it shouldn't take too long to download. It said downloading. Uh, I think it's poorly translated and it actually wasn't downloading. You have to hit the button, the downloading button, and now I believe it is actually downloading because you can see something going on. Uh, we were sitting here for about 10 minutes going, why isn't this thing done? It's only 84 megabytes, it should be finished. But as soon as I touched it, it started actually doing this. And so we think it's downloading now. Um, it says 0%, updating 0% but we're gonna let this sit for a few minutes. It might actually be downloading and, or it might've finished downloading and was just sitting there waiting for you to push the button. But um, you would think it would say push here to download or something. But anyway, we're gonna let it sit and up oh, 2% updating. So it is making progress. So we can actually see that it's uh, downloaded. So don't be fooled by the little button that says downloading, uh, touch it before anything. So it'll actually start working on it. Um, this also says for logged in, it also says logged in. So I think there's some uh, translation issues with it. We're gonna let it uh, do its thing for the next few minutes and hopefully it'll finish downloading and we'll be upgraded to the latest firmware. So uh, we are at the 99% mark on the update. What just happened was we, um, first of all, we started the update process uh, using the wrong end of the cable. So we flipped it around to be the small end, small USB to small USB using the adapter that DJI provides. The next thing that happened is we started the process and it said downloading, but nothing happened. It just sat there for, for a long, long time. Finally, I touched that button that said downloading and it actually started downloading. And so once it did that, it uh, actually um, started the installation process. Then it stalled out at 4%. Um, we let it sit for a long time at 4% installation. 
and it basically uh, was there for 15 minutes. We realized it had died, and so we decided to actually uh, reboot the whole thing. We rebooted the whole thing, and then it downloaded and installed smoothly. I believe that it is finished now. Let's see, prepare to, up, prepare to update. Let's see if I have to hit anything, update firmware. So it says right there, uh, so it says update success now. So it looks like we actually got the uh, update done. Hit go fly. And I guess it's not gonna let me open up the app because, um, oh, there we go. One more close up here. You can see now it says complete, right there. So I guess I just need to hit that. And it says restart your aircraft, okay. So let's go ahead and cycle everything. As far as updating the actual uh, uh, DJI uh, Phantom 4 Pro, again, summary, use the adapter cable so that you have a small USB connection on both sides, and then uh, be sure to um, uh, be patient with it if it hangs up, just restart and try it again and be sure to hit that downloading button and you'll see it um, you'll see it uh, actually start to install. Hope that's helpful. Uh, we're having a little bit of a frustrating day with this thing, but uh, we're gonna get through it and everything's gonna be all right. High class problems, right? Thanks for watching. Hope you can fly safe. Enjoy yourself. Please subscribe and we'll see you next time on Ready Set Drone.